What is going on guys, it's Eric here, and today is the first ever Minecraft commentary. This is going to be my separate episode. Walter will be doing his first episode coming soon, and then I will, then me and Walter will continue and do Minecraft for the both of us. Now this video is going to be cut down to 9 minutes, so I hope you guys enjoy. This is going to be multi-episodes of Minecraft. Now first off in the commentary I want to talk about how I got introduced to Minecraft. Well, first of all, Walter played tons of Minecraft before and I just watched. It seemed really cool, but then when I tried it, I, I was like, nah, this isn't my kind of game. But then I started watching a lot of CNANners videos and I was like, wow, this is really cool. And I started watching a little bit of Walter's videos on this whole channel. I was like, this is actually really, really sick. So I started watching this. I was like, wow, this is actually, like, you know, this is unreal. This game is so creative. You can. You just put your mind to it, and then everything happens. So, I don't know, I just I found it quite amazing. So, most of these commentaries are going to be done live, but this is the only one that's not going to be done live because I accidentally went over the limit with nine minutes <laughs> of the actual recording. So, I went, I went about 18 minutes, and the maximum length for YouTube is 18 minutes, unless you have the partnership, but we clearly don't have that. <clears throat> so we're just gonna keep going on this video. So right now, when playing this right now, I'm actually looking for a reliable place to set up. I would say camp, but I'm gonna actually say set up my my home basically, because that's what it's gonna be. Where I'm gonna set up my home, where I'm gonna start off, where I'm gonna you know make everything, where I'm gonna start off my journey or start off my story mode in start off my single player in Minecraft. So. Hope you enjoy the rest of the video as I will be commenting over it. Now what I have in my hand right now is sand. Sand is a resource, basically everything else in Minecraft is a resource, as in the dirt there to make a home, you know, a reliable kind of home. Well not as reliable. Right here I'm making my way over to the trees. Now the trees here, if you obviously break the trees, you get another resource. And what is a very good resource in this game? Maybe not, it's good to start off with, like, you know, you start off with a wooden pickaxe, you start off with a wooden shovel, and so on, and so on. But, the more wood you get, that's what she said, the more wood you get is actually really good. You can create a crafting box in your inventory, and everything else like that. So, wood is obviously a good resource, but then you can make your way over to stone, diamond, coal is actually really good, as you saw earlier when I stared at that wall, with, the. Uh, with stone with black spots that was a uh, coal which can be put on a stick which you make out of wood of course and then if you put coal like mix it like I wouldn't say mix like I'll show you earlier what I do with it if you put it together to make use sticks and coal use it put it together to make another resource called the torch and a torch lights up your home of course it's pretty self-explanatory because torch fire coal and stick right there what I picked up is called a sapling that sapling can be plants I'm sorry guys I'm very nervous this is the first commentary that sapling can actually be used to you just drop it down and then it makes another tree for resources per se the wood I'm getting right now see this tree is gonna be run out completely soon so put that down put that sapling down and I get a whole nother tree and I can get more resources and right here you see me crafting wooden you open your inventory and then you have like this little four square crafting box you put the wood down and you get planks the planks make the wood resource more I'm trying to find the right words here it makes it more 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 <clears throat> I want to say reliable but that's not the right word it makes it more useful I guess it makes it more useful so of course you have to get the wood but then you can change the wood into a wooden plank so right here is where I made the decision to start my home you know it's a very open concept kind of place and everything like that and it looks pretty good nice view and everything but I won't really be paying attention to the view and just to let you guys further know I am using a I'm on peaceful difficulty peaceful difficulty settings I'm on peaceful because you know it's the first day I don't want zombies coming at me when I have nothing so right here I made a crafting table where you can you know make stuff 
like make more things and so on so on so if I look at the crafting table it gives me four extras so if I put down my wooden planks down it gives me sticks of course so I get more sticks I get four in each then I I'm not sure what I did here and then I made a shovel and to make a shovel you put two sticks for, through the middle line you put two sticks down on the second column and then the third column and then you put a plank on the top and then you get a shovel and the shovel is mainly used to bring down dirt faster like if you had a diamond shovel it would just take all this dirt down easily of course I have a wooden shovel and then you have to progress after you collect more resources equals more stuff and so on and so on and so on so of course I have a diamond shovel. Diamond shovel is usually made usually to uh, destroy this. Of course, they can destroy cobblestone, but it take cobblestone. I apologize. I apologize for it can. The shovel can take down cobblestone, but it's actually way way harder. But the shovel can take down sand as well. It takes down the uh, little like leaves on the trees, I guess. But it does not take down the actual wood on the trees. What you have to use for that is an axe. And I believe I make one of those in the next episodes. Other than using my hands, so I can you know, make it well, amazing sound effects. <laughs> Use it for everything else like that to take down the wood. That's usually the show. I never really knew what a hoe was used for, and I'm not talking about the one you pay for sexual innuendo. I'm talking about the hoe in the actual game. So right here, you see, I ran out. Of course, the Right here I go chase down the sheep, because I want to make a bed, because I think nightfall is going to come soon. But what I want to explain why I ran out, the diamond shovel has like a limit. A uh, diamond, the sh any weaponry or tool, I'll just say tool from now on, the tool you have actually has like a little health bar, and it's like a limit. Like you use this for a certain amount of time, it's going to be destroyed as soon as possible. So. As you see, I ran out because I over... No, I'm not going to say overused, but I used the uh, wooden shovel for quite some time. That makes it run out of health. I'm just going to say health from now on in the series, but I hope you guys get the key concept of what I'm trying to say. So right here, I make my way back up into my home. And right here, I don't know why I use a stick. I just should just use a wooden shovel. So I use the wooden shovel, and it does 10 times the work. A pickaxe... That's the same with any tool. A pickaxe would take down. Um, I'm saying take down, but I'm gonna say collect a resource that is of stone or diamond or any ore, basically. But sometimes you need specific picks. And right now I'm ending. I'm going down to the last minute with you guys of this first episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you want to see more Minecraft, be sure to subscribe to Walter and Eric on this channel, please. It helps tremendously if you like the video give it a thumbs up and put in the comments down below why you like the video so you know we can we can keep doing what we're doing that makes you guys like the actual video if you didn't like the video hell give us a dislike and tell us why in the comments below so we can improve on our game next time we make a video if you want to go see our first ever upload it's on our channel at Walter and Eric it's called Eric's Spastastic Adventures episode one that features me running around with the spaz 12 and mono Fair 2 sadly my ps3 broke as you see there i make a pickaxe so you know i'll see you guys later this has been eric and i am out